Is your Mac cursor frozen? It can happen quickly. You're about to send an important email when your Mac cursor suddenly won't move. Don't worry, we can show you how to fix it just as fast. In this video, we're going to walk you through some quick fixes to get your frozen MacBook cursor moving again. If your cursor freezes right after opening an app, try force quitting the app to see if that gets things moving again. To force quit, press and hold the Command, Option, and Escape keys at the same time to access the Force Quit Applications menu. Use the up and down arrow keys to highlight the app you want to close. Press Tab to select the Force Quit button, then hit the Return key. A dirty trackpad can sometimes cause your Mac cursor to misbehave. Always keep your trackpad clean and free of debris. To clean your trackpad, power down your MacBook and spray a cleaning solution on a microfiber cloth. Gently wipe down and remove any dirt, stains, or debris on your trackpad. You can make your own cleaner by mixing distilled water with 70% alcohol. Never spray the cleaner directly on your computer. If you're using a Bluetooth-connected mouse, check the charge. It could be running low and need to be plugged in or have its batteries replaced. Then test the Bluetooth connection by unpairing and pairing the device. Open System Preferences and click Bluetooth. Find your device on the list and click the X next to it to disconnect. Pair the mouse again by clicking Connect. Make sure the device is close to your MacBook or it won't pair. If your Bluetooth mouse still won't connect, it's time to restart your computer. To restart your MacBook, unplug all accessories. Press and hold the power button for a few seconds until your computer powers down. Wait a few seconds before turning it back on again. This step can troubleshoot issues with your operating system and most likely will fix a frozen cursor. For professional help fixing your tech, visit Assurian.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips.